legendary good company but but more than likely this movie's gonna be terrible i'm really watching it because i really like the uh, original like a lot of people i'm just curious to see what they do with it but more than likely i'm gonna mess it up but you never know how do i look like a writer <sighs> oh everybody brings something you know, I heard that Mark Twain got rejected 34 times before he got published. That's brutal. Mark Twain. Yeah. Indiana. Ha <laughs> ha, there you go. They gotta have the, well, they gotta show the leg lamp. A close encounter with Delbert Bumpus, the smartest member of the hillbilly family next door. <laughs> Oh man. Snowmen don't last long around here. That's supposed to be the bully. Christmas plans. <laughs> Mark and I'm a writer, so focus on getting into the I'm, Christmas um, spirit. I'm relating a lot to this movie so far. Now I need to know exactly what year it was. It is. Larry? What do you want from me? I come here to avoid my family. <laughs> Alright. Well, uh, he's all hungover. Ralph, it's almost ten. Are you awake? Ah, uh, make them catch and kill their own turkey. Ooh, <laughs> maybe we could combine that with the axe throwing. You are the writer in the family. Uh, tell that to the publishing industry. Yes, uh, I'll just have to think of what to say. <laughs> they probably got inspired by um, <gasps> Christmas Vacation. I needed to get Christmas. You know what I like? Rails. They didn't make it like a parody of the original, like how they did with the uh, the Brady Bunch or something like that. Even though that's funny when they do it right. Hey, you're still doing a slide. Don't let him kick you in the face. Huh? That's exactly what happened. He's gonna throw up. Oh! Jeez, get the mop. Go get the mop. Come on, you gotta put it out of here. Come back tomorrow. I really shouldn't drink this much. They had the mop on standby. Yes, I was there. Oh, what? Don't tell me somebody takes all their Christmas gifts. Oh, little pirate. I'm gone. I knew it, man. My mind grapples with the grim reality that every dollar we had set aside for Christmas was spent. Son of a bitch. You got that <laughs> right. Wanna play spades? One eye jacks? <laughs> One eye jack. Suds for dad. Shirley Temple for the kid. To a bar or a restaurant? Cheers. Cheers. Nothing. I remember uh, reading somewhere that cars didn't even have seatbelts back then. Even in the 70s. What do you want? I'm fixing to feed the lobster. I oh, like what is he eating? Cheese? She must have gotten out somehow. Brick? No way. Yep. You got it. Just go right down there. Hey, thanks, kid. You're all right. Oh, oh. You really made him a real drink? Answer. Is Junior here? Junior Kissel? What about um see more butts? The ramp. There it is. An abandoned experiment from the Army Corps of Engineers <laughs> in winter it transfer. Hey, you gonna go down? Or we're gonna stand here and freeze our nuts off? If revenge is a dish, <laughs> best. There's no way I'm gonna kill myself for this. It's crazy. Hey, Schwartz! I triple dog dare you! Oh. Oof. Gotta oh, do God. it now. I got Okay, we we should probably move out of the way. Huh. Hey, 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 Ralphie. Where's he gonna land? Let's wake up, Schwartz. man. No. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to get a book published without a uh, an agent first. They don't tell me he's gonna write the Christmas story, the original movie. Kill us. <laughs> oh, boy. 
and we're going to have a great Christmas. <laughs> His voice changes when he screams. Yeah, that looks like Back to the Future. Clothes for Xmas. Go drink at home. <laughs> There's a beer logo on it. <laughs> Christmas would be saved. Ah. Right Looks like Conan O'Brien a little. Brought you a present. <laughs> Her eyeballs all messed up. Oh, forget jail. He's gonna take him home. Party calendar. Disco. Disco. Look at that. Disco. I don't know. I think she looks a little too modern. Radiator. <laughs> Radiator. No, it's gonna get hired at the newspaper. Hello. The old man would be proud. Yeah, he would. Two hundred shot range model air rifle. Haha, <laughs> I knew that's what he wrote. Alright. So is it better than the original? No. Just as good? No. But not terrible, it's not bad. Pretty good. But it's hard to top that original, man. To me, it's, it just has something to do with the look. It has that uh old classic kind of looking cinematography i guess you know what you can call it i guess the old cameras and film they used to use back then gave it a certain look and now it looks too polished too modern the story is good man i like it funny but is it going to be like a classic like the kind of movie you watch every christmas i don't think so maybe but no nah, i don't think so See, like, my list is um, maybe a yeah, Christmas story, the original. Scrooge with uh, Bill Murray. Christmas Vacation. It's probably another one, but those are my go-to Christmas movies. I don't know if, um, if this was going to be on that list. I don't know. But would I recommend it? Yeah, I would. So from 1 to 10, I'm giving this here an 8. It might not be as good as the original, but it's rewatchable. Catch you on the next one. Counterfeiting is a billion dollar business perpetrated by thousands of people throughout the world. Meet Kimo, one of those people. Kimo is a young man from the most dangerous city in America. After losing his job, he ventures into the risky business of counterfeiting to help relocate his family to a better place. <laughs> 